Um, my name is Leon, I'm from Regensburg, and I would like you to present a new way to register custom properties for the Magic Media Wiki with um, data which are available already somewhere. Maybe you have some data in, in different tables on your database or somewhere else and you just want to append it to your wiki page. And this is an example um, what it can be looked like. Um, I prepared two extensions um, I used already in some versions and um, there's hit counter and parent page and um, these properties are automatically generated with um, the extension I would like to present. And um, also it's maybe for some people interesting to make data available which is not accessible by user um, so that user can read it but not change it. Because if you have your, um, your um, data in the wiki context, um, everybody can change it and it's, um, it's not every, every time useful. So if you have semantic um, special properties, it's like fixed and user have just read access to it. Okay, and many of you I think know um, already available semantic extra special properties extension. And um, I thought it's, it's pretty cool and it's working and everyone can select which property to use when you use local settings and but it's very limited if you have your own extensions with available data you have no way to extend it and um, in input your own data and for that I wanted to make something like this it's pretty equal just another name and you make your extension data available well, um, if you first you have to install install um, SMB connector. It's uh, also available in Composer, so you can just type the name and it will be installed and available. After that, you uh, it's more interesting for programmers, um, but later we will see some practical examples. Well, uh, you define um, most things. Um, if, you, if you're a developer, you know that it's most equal to the definition of um, special properties from the original um, extension. And um, there is just a mapping function. This is a difference. And the mapping function gives the data for the current page. Well, and this is the mapping function. It's in your custom extension and um, where the data is and the extension is aware of where the data is stored and what kind of data, it can be a number um, or a page or something like this. And you see in the, in the last line you see the number and this is from a hit counter. I extended it, so um, it's an extension from Mark and um, he created it because maybe because uh, current media that you don't have a hit counter anymore so view counter, how many times the page had been viewed and um, before it was available for us and now not so um, I created just an extension to make it available again and it was like um, a short task because of such a tool well and now we are on examples um, I wanted to create a page navigation with a tree but if you use the tree format you need a property in every page with a parent linking but it wasn't available so I created um, an extension parent page um, and this extension appending an attribute to every page with the current parent page well this is the ask query and there is a result we can also take a look on, a, on another example yeah, this is um, the result of hit counter. So I think it's nothing special for you, but um, it's from the custom property. Oh. Yeah, that's it. We have here 
you have a tree and you just uh, say okay from the current page I want all sub pages um, and the sub pages are aware of the current page and the same as here in the hit counter yeah I think nothing special but on the other side you directly get your um, your content and this is not user editable so I can access properties but it's not really useful um, I, I can't change it so it's safe user safe well are there any questions Okay, if you like to uh, look at the documentation, you can find it directly on mediawiki.org and um, there is an explanation how to develop uh, your own extension. Of course. Um, so, as you can see, there is a type attribute, and the extension is completely based on on special extra properties. So, I use the same types, of course, because it's needed and uh, extended. And you have to define which type you use. Here, type nine is a page, and type one was a number, I think. And here is like a number. Um, so you have to define here type no number one, and here you have you can go here. Here is number five. And, um, there you can also set a wiki page or something, but you have to use SMV types. It's not um, working with um, media wiki types because it's um, yeah, it's a waiting SMV type response. Other questions? No? Okay, thanks for listening.